Turbo Mosaic is a photo mosaic maker that lets you make a photo mosaic from your pictures within a few seconds. I will show you how to make a photo mosaic like this in this video. Let's make our first photo mosaic. First, open Turbo Mosaic and select an output size for our mosaic. I will use a 48 inches wide and 36 inches high size for this mosaic. Let us select the main picture for this mosaic. Here's a photo mosaic and the corresponding main picture. The main picture is the one we're trying to create from other images. Let us pick the main picture for this mosaic. Let us crop the main picture to focus on the couple's faces. Let us add tile pictures to our mosaic. You can add as many tile pictures as you want. A large number of tile pictures with a broad range of colors work best. Let's generate our mosaic. Let's zoom in to see how tile pictures are placed. Let's export our mosaic to a JPG image. You can also export it in PNG or TIFF image formats. Let's open the exported mosaic JPG. You can print the exported JPG image using a local printer or a printing service of your choice. You can also email or share it on social media. To crop a mosaic tile, click to select it and use the crop tool. Notice the crop tile picture. You can drag a picture from the picture's pane into a tile. You can easily exchange pictures in two tiles. By default, the photo mosaic uses square cells. You can use the cell size setting to use rectangular cells. Here's a sample mosaic that uses rectangular cells with a 3 is to 2 aspect ratio. By default, the picture tiles are joined together. Let us add some space between tiles. Let us set a color to fill the space between tiles. As of now, we're using black color. Let us switch to using white color. Let us set the main picture to appear through the space between tiles. Notice how the tiles are placed in front of the main picture, which shows through the space between the tiles. Some tiles in the photo mosaic may not match the main picture well. Cell colorization tints these tiles to match the main picture better. Let's undo this. Let us partially draw the main picture in front of the mosaic. This makes the mosaic look more like the main picture. Let us undo this. Let me explain the cell mirroring setting with an example. Here's a zoomed mosaic. Notice the two highlighted tiles. They are the same picture mirrored left to right. The cell mirroring option allows using the original tile picture or its mirror image whichever matches better. If you turn it off, only the original tile picture will be used. Let me now explain the duplicate spacing setting with an example. Here's a mosaic with a duplicate spacing set to zero. This means that the same tile picture can be used next to each other, like the coffee cup picture here. Here's another mosaic, with a duplicate spacing set to two. Notice the coffee mug picture has at least two different pictures in between. I will now show you, how to make a photo mosaic with diamond shaped tiles. I will also show you, how to make a photo mosaic with circular tiles. In the end, I will show you, how to make a photo mosaic with hexagonal tiles. Let us select the diamond cell style, to make a mosaic with diamond shaped tiles. Generate the mosaic. Let's zoom into the generated mosaic. Let's select the circular cell style to make a photo mosaic with circular tiles. Generate the mosaic. Let's zoom into the generated mosaic. Let's select the hexagonal cell style to make a mosaic with hexagonal tiles. Generate the mosaic. Let's zoom into the generated mosaic. If you find this video useful, 
please like it and subscribe to our channel.